In this video, we will look at integrations using New Relic Flex. Flex is an application agnostic all-in-one New Relic integration with which you can instrument any application that exposes metrics over a standard protocol. With Flex, you can take any input using data source APIs, process it through functions, and send metrics to New Relic. Flex is there by default with New Relic Infrastructure Agent. For the most accurate information, please check the Flex GitHub page. I highly recommend reading the blog post, check the variety of examples we have, and follow the step-by-step -step tutorial, which is what I'm going to do now. I have a machine with the infrastructure agent installed, and I can switch directory to the integrations directory. We'll create an integration YAML file with this text. Paste the text to the file and save the file. In the first Flex integration, you may need to restart the infrastructure agent. The Flex executable is located in this directory and you can use it to test the scripts manually. In this case, I'm gonna use the config path pointing to the integration YAML file and the minus pretty to get a JSON result. We can now switch to the UI and look for this event type. We can go to query your data, the data explorer, and look at the flex status sample. Now that we have flex running successfully, we'll try something more interesting. We'll take the second example from the step-by-step -step tutorial and add the ping URL example from GitHub. In this case, we'll ping a machine as well as the new relic site. Note that in this case, the results will be under file system sample event and ping sample event. We can again run Flex manually just to make sure everything is running fine, look at the result, and then switch to the UI. We can see file system sample, Flex status sample, and ping sample under custom events. We can look at the data, build charts, create dashboards, and alert on this information. I hope you find this video useful. Thank you very much for your time.